startup of one screw boilers one screw boilers part 2 schematic of a one screw boiler here we are having boiler feed pump economizer evaporator separator where steam and water droplets are being separated a storage vessel or separator drain tank where water droplets get collected dump to condenser excess water is dumped to condenser boiler circulation pump water collected in storage vessel is circulated back to evaporator the attached figure shows an outline of the typical water and steam circuit in a once through boiler including the startup recirculation system request it is hoped that this lecture is going to be useful to you please press like please subscribe water flows versus boiler load for a once through boiler the figure shown is a graph of typical relationship between the recirculation spill evaporator pass and overall feed water flows across the boiler's load range at first before firing commences a small flow from the main feed pumps is fed to the furnace inlet since there is not at any fuel to generate steam it is all collected by the separator and directed to the storage vessel the storage vessel is shown in second slide where it is recirculated to the furnace by the boiler recirculation pump the bcp maintains a high level of flow through the furnace walls well in excess of the water being fed from the main feed pump in this way the minimum flow through the wall tubes is achieved However since the main feed pump flow exceeds the steam production the drain tank fills and a dump valve to the condenser opens dump to condenser flow is shown
as fuel flow and steam production rises the spill to condenser reduces to zero while the bcp continues to maintain a recirculation flow with increasing fuel input and steam production the ratio of recirculation flow to main feed pump flow reduces until finally the steam production matches the minimum furnace flow requirement at this point bcp flow is close to zero and it is turned off the boiler is now in once through mode the control system regulates the fuel and feed water systems to ensure the steam at the separator outlet remains dry with a margin of superheat request it is hoped that this lecture is useful to you please press like please subscribe